Well, I didn't really find it. I don't know where it is in the controls. It's probably like in here, isn't it? Okay, if I press Y, let's just turn that off for now. <laughs> let's disable and enable the deletion of stamps. Okay, so I really think that before that I probably did like the last time I died was right at the Temple of Time. As it probably should be. As one time ends, another one begins with Link dying at the Temple of Time. And now that I notice it, I probably should like grab still all of the Stamilla Shrooms because I need... I need to cook up some excellent dishes. Oh, little twin bridge! Okay, I guess that basically does give you the giant hint in the world saying, Hey, go this way, follow the waterfall, you dummy. Then you'll get some good eats and stuff. Hey goat, can I ride you? No, I guess not. I think he's running closer towards me slightly, but not at the same time. Yeah, anyway, I'm going to cut it very slightly ahead to when I actually go and talk to those people, because I want to uh, see what they say about my endeavors. Oh, what's... what's this? I don't like that he always just yells at me going, Hey, you can get directions from me! Also, I don't know if this is a really good location for them to be living, because it's like right on the edge of the cliff, and it's just like... It's a good landmark, so then they know where they have to go to get back home. But, at the same time... I'll keep Kronos on there. A lot of their daylight is shafted by the mountains getting in the way. Hello there, guys. Okay, I guess... The, almost there, just a bit more, and I'll have the whole thing worked out. Get it out! Get out of here, man! That's, that's amazing! You've almost figured it out. Well, I already solved it. Yeah, I guess, like, these. this is pretty much the exact same dialogue as before, but now I can actually say that I solved it and actually be truthful. Uh -huh. Hmm? You're lying! Huh. Yeah, definitely lying. Uh -huh. Yeah! There's just no way a rookie like you could solve a puzzle before Dak. No chance. Tell the guy. Beat it, Dak. Or <laughs> that also could work too. He's he's very upset. Uh, Dak. And he wants it to him to beat it, just like Michael Jackson. Got to be singing all the songs. Quiet, Prison. Trying to think. Ugh, just a little bit more time to solve this. And then they go up to the top of the hill, and they're just like, oh yeah, well. How come I... like, we, we solved it, but then why isn't there anything in here? Mom? Oh, she says that every single time I steal an apple. The place really does just reset itself. Okay, I might need to... Call my horse. Horsey! Oh, boy. Well, it's almost night time, so... I have an idea. I might need to go and attack. The one, the only, skeleton monster. I'm probably gonna die horribly, but if I beat him, then it will be impressive. So, I'm going to go night. I'm gonna just sit by here until the night time, whenever that is. Hopefully, it doesn't actually put me to, like, midnight. It just puts me to, like, hey, here's, here's some night time. Oh, I just thought of something. You guys still are open. Okay, good. I need you to call my horse. <laughs> but it's not daytime. He's just like, oh, you're looking peppy today. No, you should be saying I look peppy this evening or this night. I'd like to take my horse. Bluerson, the greatest of steeds. Oh, we actually have uh, Max Bond. That's pretty good. Almost sounds like it is also some sort of uh, itch relief cream or something. Although that's a little bit different, but oh well. Oh well, Bluerson, we have one more shot at this. I think the best option would be to just be as mobile as possible. So, actually I should have been cooking things beforehand. What do I have that makes me fast? Or do I have anything that makes me fast? Well, I, I do have a couple things that are... Yeah, I'll, I'll eat the small uh, agility thing. And then get going into combat. It probably will work out. All I know is that at some point I'm just gonna have to like cook the greatest of meals. I'm gonna sue them a bit more because even if we are Max Bond, or that's another just—it's another name for all. 
It's like James Bond, but it's his... His brother that wasn't very famous, that nobody likes. Hey, look, it's Max Bond! Oh, no. No, 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 Bluerson. Oh, boy. You were so close to death. Because... If he went into the water, I'm pretty sure that the horse would just immediately die. Or at least... In that kind of way. Alright. Well... It's getting to be... Midway through... Well, not really. It's getting close to midnight, let's just say that. And when we're getting close to midnight... We gotta fight... The Skeleton Lord of Legend. Oh boy, this is gonna be a bad idea, but at least I do have some pretty good weapons. Okay, here we go. Oh, maybe it was just becoming daytime that other time when he just, like, left. But I want to say it's because I was just being awful. Because that would make the most sense. Oh no, I can't aim that high up. Okay, here's the plan. Since he's doing this right now, I gotta just attack. Okay, stay be beneath him. He can one-hit you. <laughs> okay. Good to know. <laughs> That's the first time I got hit by a boss, ever. <laughs> Let's see when this last save was. Hopefully it was right before the fight. Because if it was, then there's no penalty for dying. And man, I'm instantly going to be awful at this game now. <laughs> oh yeah, I never die. Oh boy. Well, this is pretty much exactly where I wanted to be. Please, sir. Don't. Don't you do anything. Stand still for half a second. I can't see your eye. Stop putting yourself behind trees. There we go. Slash and dash. Okay, now is the time to run. Don't stay close to him. Oh boy. So I think you have a better chance at dodging if you're a little bit farther back. Oh, here we go. Yeah, you just have to make sure that he gets into a place that he wants to attack you. And as soon as he wants to attack you, then you can actually, like, dodge and stuff. Also, it looks like there's a sword. Oh no. He was just. Okay, I thought that he was going to use his ribs as a weapon. But there's there's a, a sword inside of... Oh, no. Inside of him. I'm going to have to move the sword, also known as the camera. Here we go. Come on. Attack me. Oh, okay. Yeah, he definitely stands still if you just get close enough to him. So... Yeah, I know. My guardian sword is supposed to break. That's the whole point of it. Because now we go to the Eightfold Blade. Which might do slightly more damage. Who knows? Oh, you think it can hit me? You think it can, it can hit me, Stalax, the, the axial person? Duh. Here we go. This blade does not have very good uh, attack power. Am I supposed to, like, do something with this? Or am I supposed to... Well, you know what? I'm gonna still attack the eye. Uh oh. Okay, I probably shouldn't have done it that way. All in all, I think that I made the wrong choice. Okay. Is he, he's standing still. Oh! Boy! Okay, and also I made an awful noise. So... You gotta make him stand still, for one. You gotta be making him jump sideways into death. Uh, when I, he's down that low of damage, I probably should just, like, attack his body and see what happens. Because if I break his body and then his eye just is gone, then maybe it would be fine? Uh, let's check if I have my... Yeah, I have my weapons back. This is no problem. I actually prefer having uh, you just die easily like this. Because then I know what I'm doing more so. Also, you know what? I think I am going to uh, grab myself uh, some good old-fashioned recipes. Three minutes to kill? I think I should be able to do it. Hopefully. If I'm not, then uh, that's going to be awful. And also, I think I should charge up. Okay, I got to get out of there. He's going to pound. Oh, no. Get out of the tree. Woohoo! <laughs> 
Oh, I think he just threw a part of his, his body at me. Also, I couldn't see him for a second there. I think if I climb him, then I can grab... Okay. Then I can grab the sword just, like, immediately out of him. That might be a thing, partially. Oh, well, I guess gotta mash the buttons. Also, I don't know if I, I, I would even be able to climb him, to be honest. You'd think that you'd be able to. Oh, no, please. I go pick up a tree. Yeah, you, you like trees? I hear they're pretty good at this time of year. Trees. There we go. A couple more hits, and this will break. Does a lot of damage. That's the whole reason why you use your breakable weapons first and foremost. Uh, eightfold blade, even though this is a bad idea. So I don't think I really need my shield so much. But I think I do. Because <laughs> that, was, that was close. There we go. I'm gonna attack his body. Okay, no, it it's not attacking the body. This is the time that you're supposed to attack the eye. And you get chances to uh, jump slash and whatnot. Yes! Stay away from the bo- Oh no! He is uh, very agile at being able to grab his eye. Okay, here we go. Stand still. Oh no, he's getting smarter. Okay. Here's the plan. Okay, avoid the bear. <laughs> That's currently the plan. He's gonna throw that, isn't he? How did I survive? I really should be dead. Okay. I don't think I have many other plans. Also, it looks like I ran out of arrows anyway, so... Uh, bear. Bear, save me. <laughs> this is not good. Do I have damage resistance? Uh, it doesn't really look like it. Okay. I don't have any uh, other plans. <laughs> so... Win? Okay. I could grab that wood. Okay, he's... I can't stun him, that's the one problem that I have here. Well, one of the couple of problems. Oh, there we go. I don't know if he'll be able to one-hit me when in this mode. I'm standing still way too much. Yeah, he can one-hit me. <laughs> oh, boy. I'm doing better, all in all. Don't discount my ability to be getting better. I need more arrows, though. Now I understand why people buy arrows. They may be expensive, but they are useful. So, here's the thing about this. I have to never miss a shot. Because I don't want to miss a thing. Not gonna miss shooting you in the eye. Evil man, I missed my shots. So I'm going to die right now. There we go. I think it's time to use uh, high damage first and foremost. It's a boss, I might as well use strength and power. Because it does so much more damage. Uh, discount that one. Don't, don't even pay attention to it. That was just uh, that was a practice run with my uh, big strong sword. That does a lot of damage. So, hoo -hoo, um, yeah. Anyway, my mighty steed, I must go alone for this fight. I will survive, kill this thing, and cr create. I think it's a different weapon now. Like it, it's like a different weapon whenever you. Oh no! Come on, come on. There you go. Or no, there's just multiple weapons all over him, it looks like, actually. Okay. I I think that you just have to smack and grab. There we go. Ooh. That that wave is a bit too big. I was dodging out of the way, man. <laughs> this is actually taking way too much time than I thought it would. Because this is actually kind of difficult if you have no equipment and no hearts.
<laughs> and only stamina. I'm gonna take a couple more chances, though. Okay, one shot to the eye is all you need. Then you charge this down, actually, as I wanted to. Oh, it didn't actually do anything. I think I have to charge it more. Okay. Back away, his uh, AoE is pretty big, but... That's the one problem with this weapon, is that it does do a lot of damage. But... It does take a long time to wind up and... Just... Do anything, really. <laughs> Woo! Okay, here we go. Another hit to the eye. I'm down to six. I gotta start counting bullets now. Also known as... Uh, arrows. Here we go. You think you can do that to me? You probably can, but not this day. Because, uh... Ugh. Come on, jump slash! Jump slash! If I just keep it away... Oh, okay. Well... I kept it away from him for a bit of time. Oh, boy. I don't like that I cannot lock on properly sometimes. Okay, go ahead, throw your bones at me. Woohoohoo, that was close. That probably would have one hit me as well. Oh no, I can't get the proper aiming on that. Oh no, now he's actually getting into like full on mode. This is going to be difficult. But now's the time to start having my uh, rushing of ability to run. Here we go. Because we get close up to him. Hey, come on, attack me. And then we go farther away. Come on. Oh, <laughs> that was... That was not what should have happened, but... I will take it. I think this is also the time that I need to start going into fast weapons again. So, 20 damage it is. Here we go. Come on. Woo! I don't know how that actually works. It really shouldn't. Okay, maybe right... There we go. Attack, attack. Jump attack. Constantly not stopping attacking. Come on. Another couple hits and he'll be... Oh no. Perfectly dead. It's a thing. It can be perfectly dead. He's not. He's imperfectly dead right now. He's coming back to life. Oh boy, this is definitely the way I think the game is meant to be played, though. Because. Oh, here we go. Yes. Is okay. It's badly damaged, so that means it will do lots of damage on him. Wait. He can't be dead already, is he? Oh. Yes. I did it. <laughs> It seemed a bit too easy when I actually did finally beat him. Oh! Hinox Tooth. A tooth obtained from a Hinox. It's so large, it's hard to believe it's a real tooth. It can be used to make elixirs. Okay, there's another tooth. Oh boy, look at this loot. There's a Knight's Halberd. This is better than the one thing that... Well, actually... Eh, it still is better, I guess, kind of, than what I was... Using to fight him in a way. Yeah, it's it's modeled after an axe because it's kind of that's what a halberd is. It's an axe with a spear on it or a spear with an axe on it. Whatever. Giant boomerang. This massive boomerang requires two hands. Originally used for hunting, it was modified to use as a weapon. The blades on the inner curves make it a bit tricky to wield. And this one, this is what I saw glowing on him that I wanted all this time. What is it? Thunderblade, a magical sword forged and refined by lightning from the Hyrule Hills. When the blade shines with a golden light, it will electrocute enemies struck by it. So I guess it's similar to the flame blade, but it's it's Thunderblade. <laughs> Man, I was making uh, references to ooh, what's this? Oh yeah, these are just uh, pieces of wood and stuff because it. We made uh, short work of a few of the uh, things around here. <laughs> that was worth fighting and dying over, I think. Because that was actually really awesome fighting 
still and, and dying that much because if the game isn't hard then what's even the point you know it's best to actually have a bit of challenge like I just did there because that was that was some challenge Ooh, man that was awesome but now I have to just reorganize some weapons <laughs> Okay, that sort of works as a sorting technique now. Or sorting technique. Nah. It's not even funny. But I don't know if I should actually be using my... Actually, I think I should probably use the Eightfold Blade first, even though that's the only one-handed weapon that I currently have other than my Flame Blades and Thunder Blades and stuff. But I will use the uh, fancy kind of blade like this for now. Because the fact that the halberd is actually really good if it's 13. 13 damage compared to 15, you can do a lot more DPS with a halberd. Oh no, it's a bear! You know what, I'm gonna shoot you in the face, bear. Okay. Hey, bear. Come on, let's play Ring Around the Rosie. Okay. Here's the thing about the bear. Hey, he's definitely running away. Yeah. Bears are more afraid of you than you are of them! Come on! Come on! Stop running away from me! <laughs> what is going on here? <laughs> Does a bear have like a lot of really good stuff on him or what? He's just like, oh no, please, I have a family! I'm just like, no! We won't for long! I'll kill them too! There you go, you're trapped against a tree! Wait a second, did it just say mount? Yes! I'm going to mount a bear. Here we go. Soothe, soothe, soothe. <laughs> okay, let's do this. I'm gonna- I'm gonna mount a bear. <laughs> Come on, soothe him, soothe him! <laughs> I have a bear! I... okay! I really did not expect this. But, you know what? This is gonna be good for thumbnails. <laughs> if nothing else- hey, 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 come on. Soothe, bear, soothe. <laughs> Just look at this! Oh no, please! Don't run off to the edge of the world! Bear, you have so much to live for! There we go, that's a good angle. Ah, oh, he's just so friendly now. You just have a giant bear that you're riding for whatever reason. <laughs> I'm gonna keep him for a little bit. At least until I get to the stables and then see what they say. I was like, oh yeah, would you like to uh, put a saddle on this? Oh, it's a bear! Oh! This is horrendous! Okay, here we go. Casually walk down here. It's I know it's a little bit unsafe because we have a cliff but Mr. Bear as I like to call you uh, you are <laughs> uh, Very important to my cause <laughs> I knew that you could ride like elk in this game or still I probably could have rode that bull I probably could have and that would have been amazing because Link could be the greatest of cowboys I have no idea how much stamina a bear actually has, but I'm just like pounding him into the submission. And also trying to soothe him a little bit. Cause I don't know if a bear you could really soothe if you're... I don't know if any of this actually makes any sense whatsoever. I'm gonna soothe a bear that I am uh, riding by patting him and going, yes, good bear. I'm going to uh, make you feel nice and calm. <laughs> pet you a little bit, because bears, as we all know, like to be petted. Very much so. I'm really excited to see what they say, because they, they must have some sort of dialogue in this game for this. Hello! Do you guys want to talk? I have a bear! Oh, come on! I gotta just... He, the bear doesn't want to stop. That's the one problem. Here we go. Looks like you've caught yourself a new steed. Would you like to register it? Yes, please. Not a problem, let me just... Oh, for the love of Hylia, that's not a horse. <laughs> I love that he just, like, I guess this is just the dialogue for anything that's not a horse. <laughs> he's just like, oh, for the love of Hylia, because it's just like, 
This is a bear. So you should be frightened. Who just says like, oh, it's just we only board horses here, stranger. No exceptions. We don't board bears here, stranger. No exceptions. <laughs> what the heck? I have a bear. I have a bear. Hey, Beetle. What do you think of my new bear? Yeah. Oh, hi. We meet again. What are you looking for? Or sailing? Okay, I'm gonna see what he has to buy. He probably won't have any... Actually, he does have arrows. Oh, I, I read that as backwards, because I'm just like, how come you can buy uh, one arrow for 20, or five arrows for two? But no, I was just reading it totally wrong. I'm not going to waste any uh, money on arrows currently, because apparently you can buy armor, and the armor is fairly expensive. Here we go. Let's go. I'm totally going to be keeping this bear for a little bit. He doesn't have the best stamina, but it's faster than walking, as far as I know. Also, at some point, I might want to go through this field here and just, like, grab as much as I can. Grabbing everything I can! No way, is it really that close? It looks so far away, but it's, it's actually really not. To be able to get to that to other area there. But it's really weird how tame this bear is now. I guess that you can just tame bears. Bears are the friendliest of creatures. So, what do we have to do with these two trees? These look like a goalpost. So, uh, maybe if you just run through it with a horse or something, or a, the equivalent of a horse, which is a bear. Oh, come on, come on, Mr. Bear. Come on, there we go. Oh, and that's also, you can reset the camera. That's nice. Well, it actually tells you that that's exactly the same as the other Legend of Zelda games. But yeah, there are a lot of uh, dead guardians around here. I could probably scrap them completely for parts. Because, as far as I know, that's kind of the thing that you do. I don't know what the parts are used for, but they're probably something useful. And also, yeah, this field seems to be completely useless. Other than for parts... Hey, you. I'm riding a bear. What are you uh, riding? Nothing. You know what, I'm gonna get off the bear and then see if they fight him. Here we go! Attack! Go, bear! Okay, I don't think... No, the bear's running away! No! You're even worse than the horses in Skyrim! Come back here! You foul beast! You're supposed to be my friend! Oh, boy. Still, there are, there are a lot of... Aw, oh, the bear just ran away. Yeah, because as soon as you get off of him, then he just doesn't want to be anywhere near you anymore. I should have just kept riding the bear in combat. Yeah, because look, even the enemies run away. Like, well, all... Because the bear's technically an enemy, too, I think. But they... They all just run away. It's a problematic thing. There we go. Two and one. Oh, no. Oh, that didn't count as a fury rush. That's not a fury rush. I don't know what is. There we go. That's some fury. That's some rushing. Okay, well, what other good weapons do I have? Or actually not good weapons, that is. Because a soldier's claymore is a bit too good, I think, to be wasting on them. I'll just use a halberd. Because look at how much DPS you get with it. It's insane. Uh, soldier's broad sword. Broad, broad sword. I can't speak properly. Okay, I'm just going to collect some... Ah, Broco Club. This is why I think of your clubs. They're nowhere near as good as the clubs that... Ooh. I'll take one of those. Or... I'll... I will... Can you throw... Well, I guess you could just do this. And just keep running. There we go. Boko Shield badly damaged. And... There we go. <laughs> That's the easiest way of getting rid of, uh, shields. So, so what other shields do I have? Well, yeah, I'm still gonna use the rusty shield until it breaks. Which I probably should just make it break, because it looks like crap. Hey, shoot up my shield, please. I'd very much appreciate it. There we go. Ah, whatever. I could just break it on my own if I really wanted to, just like my other shields. But... You know what you need to do? Um... Not that. 
You need a swift sword to the face. I really think that my weapons are a bit overpowered for just regular enemies. And then the bosses are actually mildly difficult, but, you know... I kind of just do my thing against them. Also, did my... No, I guess my halberd is still there, but yeah, I guess I should be using the sword anyway, because the sword is, uh... It would have technically still lower DPS. <laughs> That's why I should be using that. Probably. I don't know how it works exactly, but it's lower DPS. Oh well. Hello, chest. Give me some opal. Yeah, I still, I really want to do some uh, exploring in the way of grabbing all these stuff, all these screws and stuff, so... I kind of will on my way back, because I need a horse. And since a bear doesn't like to live with you, uh... Then that is a problem. And also, it looks like only some of them actually you can grab stuff from then. But for the most part, you get, like, you get most of it. And also, it takes so long, you can't just spam the buttons so much as you want them to. Come on! There's some ancient gears. I went and climbed right underneath that and grabbed... Come on. There you go. And grabbed it just like it is, uh... Something that you grab. How about... One of them... I don't know why I always just think of food, because I was thinking, like, chocolate. But... It's, you know how people always have, like, uh... They say, like, chocolate mousse is in, like, you know, it's, it's just like a chocolatey kind of thing in my bobber. Well... How about... Instead of, like, a chocolate bunny, you actually get, like, quite literally a chocolate mousse. And... It's a good way of doing things. Chocolate mousse. Okay, I think that I got... Oh, yes, yeah, spicy peppers. I need those. Maybe. Man, these horses are really easy to... Oh! <laughs> Maybe that's why. They were tricking me the entire time. They were pretending that they were easy to walk up on. But they just want to kick me in the face. Ow. Oh well, maybe I'll just have to eat a baked apple in front of you. How about that? Or just a regular apple. There we go. Eat a couple of regular apples, because I have a lot of them. Okay, well. Back to where I was before. Also, I think I might have been an idiot before. Let's see. No? Okay, that was definitely a different tree that I saw before. Or was it? So you gotta just check with magnetism. No, that, that dog is just an awful person. Uh, or awful dog, because it's not really a person. Or maybe a, a person got turned into a dog, who knows. Korok? No. Gotta pick up every rock, just in case. Because you never know when it might be a Korok rock. Woo! Just jump right over top of her, pretty much. 